What is up guys? It's Awana Turtle and today we're doing another Pokemon opening. Uh, I really enjoyed those tins that we've been opening previously so I went back and got some more. We have some more Pikachu Zekrom ones to be specific because I feel like that one as far as the promo goes that one's by far the best. And we'll open up another one of these mini tins this time going for the Bulbasaur and Oddish one. Um, yeah, I felt like we've been getting very good pulls on it. I do like that they have Burning Shadows and then on the team up tins or tag team tins. I feel like we've just been always been getting very good pulls. So we're going to see if we can make that continue. Uh, let's get into it. All right, guys, as usual, we're going to start with the mini tin just because I feel like we're less lucky on those ones. However, I do again like that they have Burning Shadows and oh man, this one, I feel like the the more we open these, the worse condition they get in. And we have our, as always, our metal Pokemon coin. Not to be confused with metallic coin. And two packs for Fates Collide and of course that beautiful Burning Shadows. More chances to get that Charizard. Alright. Y is three to the front. The space. All right, let's see what we got. We have a Wormadon, Servine, Shauna, Burmy, Cottony, Bronzor, Seal, Snubble, a Kabutops. That's a pretty cool art. Kabutops. Ooh, Glaceon EX. That is a nice pull right there. Um, yeah, that's the that's the. Uh, that's the good part about XY is so you get cards that you're not familiar with. This Glaceon, I feel like it looks kind of um, chibi. Not, I mean, I'm not sure if there's such thing as chibi Pokemon. Actually, I think there is, but uh, like he looks a little smaller than normal. Like his body's a little smaller, but maybe the head ratio is like compared to the head. So very happy with that pull. Glaceon, one of my favorites. Any evolution is always going to be a hit. So let's get into Burning Shadows. For that eternal hunt for for the Rainbow Rare Charizard. Alright, let's do this. Ooh, I think I saw something. Psychic Energy. Lana. Tormenting Spray. Heatmore. Wimpod. Meow. Magic Carp. Krogunk. Pikachu with the cool art, a Crab Brawler, and oh my. Oh, I think it's the, the full art. Full art. Oh, I thought it was the Charizard. This is the Salazzle full art. Very cool card. I think it was um, one of these sets. I don't think it's this one, but there's actually a Salazzle, the non GX one, which when I first got back into Pokemon, I was playing the PTCGO game. And I really liked because you could quickly just evolve them and actually so if you went second you could kind of like turn one evolve them one energy and do like this burn attack that does 40 damage per tick per, per burn tick so I felt like that was really good Let's get into this tag team team up tin. So this is the code card and the beautiful promo Pikachu Zekrom. This art is just amazing. And the cool, cool metallic GX flipper. And then we have three packs or four packs excuse me let's go with this Raichu pack art into XY all right let's see I feel like the the card in the first front after we do the trick uh, is almost always either Blastoise or uh, Charizard Spirit Link let's go for Venusaur oh Pidgeot oh there's a Blastoise <laughs> we got a switch we got a drowsy star you Ooh, Metal Energy. I thought that was DC. At first, Growlithe. Ghastly. Professor's Oak's Hint. I feel like this is a pretty good, good card. 
And then, ooh, Gyarados. Not bad, not bad. Alright, let's see. Forbidden Light. I feel like we're, we usually get pretty good pulls off this set. Forbidden Light? I wonder if Forbidden Light in general was not a... As far as the most recent sets, it feels less... Like there was less openings of it. So part of me wonders if this set... Actually, the cards are kind of uh, more sought after just because... It wasn't as big of a hit as the other ones, therefore there's just less cards in the open market. So for this we have a reverse, a Bunnel Bee, followed by a Malamar. And maybe this is one of those cards like that Psychic Recharge is just so good. For very fast ramp up for any Psychic type Pokemon. Alright, let's do the Snorlax Eevee. Since this was a Pikachu Zekromton. So, as always, if you guys are enjoying the content... Oh, this time the code's facing backwards! Uh, do me a favor, hit that like button down below. If you're new to the channel, welcome. We do videos every single day of Pokemon, and sometimes we post multiple videos, and we also do some Yu-Gi-Oh! and other stuff as well. So, um... Yeah, and appreciate all the support from all the viewers. Uh, we are getting close to that 200 sub mark. Alright, let's see, we got a Squirtle. Very cartoony. A Bronzor. A War Turtle, pretty cool, and then a Absol Hollow. Absol is actually a pretty good card. Uh, it's kind of like a utility card just because of its power. Uh, to to it's very annoying, um, where it makes your retreat cost more. And there are a lot of basic types that people will use just because, like for example, like the tag teams or like the Zapdos stuff like that, Jirachi. So quite actually has its effect uh, comes into play pretty often. All right, last pack. Let's see what we get. Darkness Energy, Ammonite, Kangaskhan, Heliolisk, Puchiana, Nidoran, Pancham, Voltorb, some keys, some buff padding for the reverse, and then ooh, unbroken bonds, guys. Muck Alolan Muck. He's gonna be a big deal. I calling it so overall a pretty good opening uh so this was a bit of a role reversal where it was the mini tin that pretty much got us our polls where we got a glaceon ex as well as the salazzle gx full art and that was actually the tag team tin that really let us down oh we, i feel like our biggest hit was a gyarados hollow which is not that great in my opinion um but either way it was definitely a fun opening but wait we have one more one more Burning Shadows back. <laughs> I'm glad I put it off to the side in, in my plain sight. so Because I, I almost forgot again. And so this is a fresh box. So, let's see what we can do. We got a Grass Energy. Sophocles. Saviper. Wick. Riolu. Cutiefly. Dewpiter. Togemaru. Wimpod, a Krogunk reverse. I feel like I get him a lot in the reverse slot. And then a Persimian. Again, it's throwing that coconut or rock or something out of Lucario. So, overall, a pretty good opening. Really happy with these two pulls right here. Uh, as always, guys, hit that like button down below. Um, again, it helps the, cam the channel grow. And uh, yeah, I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.